Good day, sir. Oh, there you are. I've been looking everywhere for you, Messiah. If only you humans didn't all look the same. I was called to the keep on important business, Bowden. Yes. I was hoping to catch you before you arrived. I came to deliver this to you, the last of the proceeds from all that treasure you found in the deep roads. It seems your friend Varric found a buyer after all, yes? Quite well done. I can put this to good use. Of course. Always happy to help. Uh, before I go, may I simply say how grateful I am that you've allowed my boy to stay in your home. I said I would repay you for saving Sandal's life, and I shall serve you faithfully. It is good to know he is safe. I didn't ask you to be my manservant, Bowden. But I owe you a debt, and after what happened in the Deep Roads, I have no other way to repay you. I'll leave you to your adventures. Your mother asks that you return to the mansion when you have a chance. I'm sure the Viscount never let a free mage step... What makes this relic of yours so valuable? The same thing that makes anything valuable. Someone's willing to pay for it. That's not evasive. Look, I didn't get where I am by showing my hand, you know. No, your hand isn't what I hear you've been showing.
a raw hawk. Messer? Last we met, I did not know your name. Did not care to. You have changed your fortune over the years. The Kunari have not. I offer a courtesy, Hawk. Someone has stolen what he thinks is the formula for Gatlock. You will want to hunt him. Sounds like the recovery should be worth something to me. A thousand lives. A stolen formula was a decoy. Sarkamek, a poison gas, not explosives. A small amount is dangerous enough to your kind, but if made in quantity, perhaps by someone intending to sell it. <clears throat> that merchant, Javaris. Would he be cautious? Or would he assume success and make enough to threaten a district? A courtesy hawk. You will want to hunt him. Any idea where we can find Javaris? I heard about a sell-off. Merchant territories and such. They don't do that unless someone left in a hurry. I'd have figured he'd rook some noble. He's sure not a burglar. Just tell me where he is. I haven't kept up on the squirt. Ask the coterie. Panahedon, Hawk. It will be interesting to see if you die. Selling the assets of Javaris Tintop. We are. Limited district, limited contracts. Keeps territory clear and separate from the start. He had a meager lot, but he skipped with dues outstanding. So up it goes. There's a lot riding on finding Javaris. Can you help? The members of our little fellowship expect privacy. But he skipped out on paying me, too. Javaris left in a hurry. I'd put him at Smuggler's Cup if he's avoiding patrols. It empties at a cave outside town. Tell him I said, don't come back. Javaris doesn't exactly sound like a masterminded work here.
Not going to happen. Get ready! You're gonna regret this! Go down! Yourself, Javaris. You're not dead yet. You? Granny's garters, she would hire you. I can't buy a break on discount. You know what? Go ahead. Take my head and pike it back to that sodding elf. I need the rest. What in blazes are you talking about? Wait, you don't know? Then what? You're tracking for the Kunari? Then she did it. That elf got them after me for nothing. Bitch barn. The obvious thief was perhaps a bit too obvious. Look, I'm minding business, same old. And out of the blue, some elf tries to kill me. Says she's got the Kunari powder and I'm her cover. I slipped her, hired some bodyguards, and ran for it. And now you're here. Great. If you're innocent, you could plead your case to the Arashok. Let's break this down. An elf with explosives wants me dead. Part two, the Kanari may think I'm a thief and also want me dead. Either option seemed promising? Didn't think so. Here, wanna drag Dark into light? I had a man follow her. The elf's in Lowtown. I just wanna get out with my dead guards. Thanks for that. Better luck wherever you're bound, Javaris. The farther, the better. Right. Got me a rosy future to plan out. Think I'll start by selling some boots.
all of you. I can't fight the damned air. You want to live? Stay out! Is there something I can do? Wait. Messer Hawk. Maker, please. The street is deaf. There was a cloud that drove people mad, and now a seeping mist that kills. All I can do is warn people. If someone like you dies on my watch, I'm right stuffed. Easy, son. Keep your post. This is my risk. But... Shit. Maker. We won't last long with this. Find the source. Lead the way. That's enough!
All of you. I can't fight the damned. It. What? All I can do is warn people. Maker. We won't last long in this. Find the source. We should get going. Should do the trickle. 
Here we go! Easy. I'm just trying to find out what happened. Is that... Sarah Hawk? You have enemies. I'm glad it's you, really. These poor people. You are a much better target. So, care to explain your particular brand of crazy? Kanari take my people. If my siblings forget their culture, then go to the Kune for purpose. We're losing them twice. So I get some help from your people. We'll take the Kanari Thunder, make some accidents, and make them hate it. But this... This is all wrong! You were going to kill people anyway. That's... not funny at all, really. It can still work. They're hidden in your city. They'll enrage the faithful and make sure the Kunari are blamed. Me, I'm finished. I just need a few more bodies. A few more. It's too far! <laughs> So, I was wrong about our thief. It appears so. 
They say we were careless with our trap, that this is our fault. But even without the Sarkamek, there would have been death. This elf was determined to lay blame at our feet. Selfishness, want, denial. How do you allow this to continue? If you dislike Kirkwall so much, why haven't you left? Since we arrived, I have seen nothing but greed and weakness. Dwarves, humans, elves, just festering. No order, no goal. You are one of the few I have met with any ability. And yet this too was random, a result of selfishness. I cannot fathom how a mire like this can be justified. You say we should leave, but how can you bear to stay in this chaos? My welcome to the city was not so different from yours. And yet you suffer it. It's an opportunity to make a real difference. Karisten are soldiers. The Kuhn made it so. They can never vary from that assigned path, never be other than they are meant to be. But they are free to choose within that role, to accept and succeed, or deny and die. Glory is clear and defined. Could you, could not this entire city benefit from that certainty? How else will you know when you have made a real difference? He's free to choose to obey. That isn't contradictory to you. He chooses to be, as do we all, long before any of your meaningless freedoms are presented. Your kind may force our role to change, if the Kuhn demands. She was angry to see her people losing their culture by claiming yours. We accept those who submit to the Kuhn. The weak naturally seek the strong. It doesn't matter. We did not come equipped to indoctrinate. I am here to satisfy a demand you cannot understand. It's been a long time. It will take as long as needed. No ship is coming. There is no rescue from duty to the Kuhn. I am stuck here. That is not the understanding of city leaders and their supporters. Let them rot. Filth stole from us. Not now, not the Sarkamek. Years ago. A simple act of greed has bound me. We are all denied Parvolin until I alone recover what was lost under my command. That is why this elf and her shadows are unimportant. That is why I do not simply walk from this pustule of a city. Fixing your mess is not the demand of the Kuhn. And you should all be grateful! Thank you, human, for your service. Leave. He's on the edge. The Viscount should know. Day, sir. Good day, sir. Years of nice, quiet anxiety. Gone. <laughs> Along with a whole street. The Canari were blameless. Right. A mad elf pushed by zealots, likely hidden in the very groups I have to appease. The Maker has a grand sense of humor. And the Arishok? 
I suspected he had no plans to leave. I didn't know it was just as annoying for him. Keep the worst of them off his back, and it'll be all right. But that is the problem. It has already escalated, despite your efforts. A shame. What happened? A Kunari delegate and entourage paid me a visit. It was civil, tentative, hopeful. They left my chambers with precision, but were not reported by the outer guard. They are missing, almost literally, from my doorstep. What do you imagine will be the Arishok's reaction? We need to get out in front of this, and fast. I feel I've been trying to turn a stampede for some time now. Someone is pushing very hard. Speak with Seneschal Bran. Then you will see why I cannot trust anyone else with this. I don't know who would benefit from fighting the Kunari, but it will cost all of us.